At 10 for the first time in five months, Milwaukee County shifts into the CDC's low COVID transmission category. That designation is based on several factors, including new cases and people in the hospital. Now with COVID numbers down, what does that mean for the flu season? Mary McCarr asked uh, Milwaukee doctors about what they expect to see this year now that we have less COVID precautions in place. The past two flu seasons have been mild compared to normal, according to health officials, but that might not be the case for this year. One of the biggest reasons for that is that people are shifting away from those rigid COVID safety measures that they've had in place for the past two years. Not wearing masks when they're out in public, um, doing more things in larger group gatherings. We do worry that that is going to increase the transmission of influenza in the community. Dr. Cousins says that might propel the flu this year back to pre-pandemic levels. We are anticipating that once flu does start to circulate in the community, um, that it could be causing serious infections and complications. Infectious disease expert Dr. Minhaj Hussein agrees. He also says it's not time to close the book on COVID and those precautions just yet. When it comes to COVID, you know, the woods are starting to thin out a little bit, but we're not out of the woods just yet. We are a lot better, um, but um, we're better because of the measures we've taken. So we need to keep those measures going. Especially now that class is back in session and more kids are back in person, this year's flu season could be tougher and spread more widely than before. They're going to schools now. Schools have all started. Um, so, so all those measures are important to keep us and our, and our kids safe. Another reason doctors think this year might be worse than the last is by looking at how badly the flu impacted the parts of the world that have already had their flu season. In the southern hemisphere was quite strong and so it was a, more aggressive than we had the last few seasons. And doctors are recommending that you get your flu shot before the end of October so you'll be safe throughout the entirety of flu season. Reporting in Milwaukee, Miriam McCarr for TMJ4 News.